Lately I've been getting a lot of questions as far as the type of hardware I use and currently I'm using a, a Sager. It's a, it's a desktop replacement. Just bought it. Great, great laptop. Very powerful. It's got a 980 no M video card in it and it's a desktop, actual desktop processor, I core, uh, what is it, Core i7 and I love it. 17.3 inch screen. I didn't get the UXGA screen, the super ultra high resolution. Just makes everything too small. Windows is notorious for not scaling things very well. So I opted to go with just the, uh, the just the standard widescreen option. Now, this is in no way a paid advertisement. HID Evolution didn't come to me and ask me to make a video. I'm making this because um, I was asked about my hardware, where I get my hardware from. So I'm making a video based off of these questions. And this is, again, I'm not getting any money from this. I'm not getting anything. Uh, so just, just to be completely, totally clear. Now, when you go to HID Evolution, you, you what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to talk to this gentleman, Donald Stratton. I've been dealing with him for well over a decade, 12, 13 years. I've over that time have bought, I don't know, 20 laptops off of him and I've had, I still have pretty much, um, I don't know, most of those laptops, a couple of them are, are now gone, but um, incredible laptops. I've been very satisfied with machines, but most importantly, satisfied with Donald. He's a top-notch guy, very honest, and uh, he's the person you want to deal with. He's Plenty of times he's saved me from overbuying, sp spending money that wasn't truly necessary. So uh, he's definitely the guy to go to. He's extremely knowledgeable, one of the more knowledgeable salespeople I've ever talked to. That's why once I found him, I never went anywhere else. So um, if you go to HID Evolution and start digging around, you can make a phone call, um, talk to the sales guys over there. I, I recommend, highly recommend you talk to Donald. And you know you can surf around through here. They got their gaming laptops, mobile workstations. Now, for those of you on a budget, you can get yourself a decent gaming laptop. I don't know, fifteen hundred dollars, two hundred, two thousand dollars, or something like that, with really good specs these days. And it will run Katia. It'll run NX. <clears throat> it'll run all your CAD programs just fine. If you're doing stuff that's a bit more uh, video heavy lots of data CAD wise or something along those lines then yeah you may want to jump into a mobile workstation and um, it's it's basically what I have again I have the 980 no M video card if you really want to get a quadro you can uh, you can spend the extra money and go for it I don't think it was necessary for what I'm doing it wasn't something that I felt that I needed and it brought the cost of my lap down 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 significantly so uh, just just things to keep in mind. And again, Donald will pretty much set you straight, and I've been dealing with him for so long. And if he has a question, he you know it's no no big deal. I have no problem with him emailing me asking me a question if somebody gets stuck or needs a bit of advice, and and it's it's pretty much reciprocal for him and I both. And again, he's not paying me. He had no idea that I wanted to do this. Um, I just sent him a notification in the mail a little while ago, email saying, hey, I was thinking about making a video because I'm getting a lot of questions as far as where I get my laptops. And um, that's that's basically how this all came to bear. So um, go ahead and surf the, through the, uh, the company. They, this company's been around quite a while. It's a good company. Um, Donald had his own company for a really, really long time, but I just think that... Uh, he just didn't feel like dealing with uh, having his own company anymore and decided to make make his life a little bit easier. He's been doing this for, I don't know, 20, 25 years, longer than some of you guys have been alive. So um, uh, I think he just kind of put it in cruise control and just wants to let life happen, which is good for him. But uh, um, good stuff here. Like I said, if you want a good mobile workstation, I highly recommend anything that the, the, the Clavo folks are doing or MSI. Um, I haven't had much experience with the Lenovo's, but they have some really good laptops from what I've seen um, as well. So uh, you know, if you like if you like the Lenovo, go for it. Um, again, my my machine, I I upped the RAM pretty high. Um, I got 32 gigs. I don't know. I got to check it. But you really need only 16 gigs. Um, what you really want to focus on is uh, 
the speed of the RAM and the speed of the hard drive, the more data that you're dealing with, the faster you need the swap speed to occur between loading data, clearing the data out. For the most part, uh, your video card is not going to be the limitation that it used to be. These, these video cards are pretty, pretty impressive. Um, so definitely focus on those. The, again, the processor, I would stick with, uh, you know, I've seen plenty of people with i5s. I would stick with with minimum of i7 because the, the amount of flops that it can handle um, versus the i5, it's really good. Um, that, that does that does make a bit of a difference. And um, so for me, like I said, I've got the 980 Noem. I've got um, 32 gigs of RAM. I've got, um, it's a Windows 7 installation. I haven't gone to Windows 10. I know Windows 7 has everything that I need and it runs all the programs that I operate uh, cleanly and I really don't feel like fighting Windows 10 at the moment, even though it's good. I have a machine that's on it, but it, uh, that I have that it that it's on, but I don't have my CAD on it. I know it'll work on most CAD these days, but um, give them a call. Do what you need to do. Um, you know, as far as putting together a good laptop, again, I, I recommend these guys, and I recommend talking to this gentleman right here. I'll I'll um, put a link. In the uh, in the lower bar down below, in, in in with Donald's name and his phone number, his extension, and um, a link to the website as well. So, um, if you decide to buy something from them, hey, let me know. I'd like to hear it.